Hi guys, today we're going to show you our battery buggy for Science Olympia 2018. And this is the car. So, mm -hmm. the car is built of some very basic components. It contains an 8 triple double A battery pack. And it contains... Right here, we can open that up. It has 8 Duracell batteries, as you can see. And we have a wooden board with fasteners holding the metal rods and the metal rods are attached to the wheels and we as you can see it's obvious that we drilled holes to lighten the weight and this is the braking system it's a wing nut and it spins down the rod when it, it so it hits the dowel spins down the rod and it spins in an opposite direction until it touches the fastener which causes the wheel to spin down the line when the when the wing nut is touching the fastener so it comes together and creates friction, which stops the car. And it's uh, more of a creative braking system. And we have, as you can see, a motor attached with a gear, and there's another gear, so we use the direct drive, and that is moving our uh, battery buggy, our vehicle. So we have a direct drive with a wing nut braking, with a wing nut slash wheel jam braking system. And the car is a very basic model. And we can turn it on. And it would probably go pretty far, but as you can see, it has a, it has a, it has a lot of speed. It has a lot of power and speed, and so in Battery Buggy, I recommend if you use a big, bigger motor, because that's the second component. See, because if, you, if your braking system works and you are at your target, then speed would be the second factor, and you might win. We, this is how we know how many turns. So we have like one turn, five turns, 20 turns. So these are wing nut rotations, and we measure them for each distance. And the, each ro each mark is a ro like 50 rotations of a wing nut. It's a 360 degree rotation, each one. So 50, that means 50, 360 degree rotations of the wing nut. So, the, for example, the 50 mark line goes about 11.7 meters. So we're going to show you the braking system right now. This is how you adjust it. So you remove the wheel. You put that there. Now you put it here. And now you just spin the wing nut to where you want it. So we're going to put it to about five rotations. And now we will drive, turn on the vehicle, and it shall move. The car does squeak, but that's not the problem. As it you just can see, squeaks. the car goes very straight. See, and it squeaks due to the fasteners. And there's, as you can see, the fasteners are very thin. And these are thin fasteners. And you can get them from any of your local boat shop. And, but there's a little problem, which you can fix easily, that the rod, it gets stuck in the thin fastener and rolls down it. So we put little straws here, we and we duct, ta it. duct taped them. So there's a straw and a duct tape, so the thing won't move. And if it does move, this gear wouldn't hit the motor. So this gear would go probably all the way in front of here, and it wouldn't hit the motor. So then it wouldn't run. So we solved that by putting straws there. And that's pretty much all about our battery buggy. Thanks for watching. Watch for our next videos.